What's up, MTU players? It's Eclectics. This will be draft number 11. We managed the trophy last time, taking us a diamond three with a couple of pips. I'm psyched, and it's that time again. It's drafting time. We open a Galta. That is a mythic. And this pack has nothing. We're taking the Galta. <laughs> but yeah, this is not a playable card. Uh, we're taking it because it's got mythic value. But it is really not a playable card. This is uh, 8 to cast, right? But by the time you cast it, you basically don't have anything in your hand already and there's no way to cheat this card into play uh except for mill so if we're in black green mill we could mill it and defossilize it on uh on five but other than that uh, we got nothing we have the hermetic nautilus passable most of these are passable even quicksand whirlpools passable All right. Deshauna. Deshauna's pretty good. Dreadmaw's Ire is maybe better. Uh, but this is a three flash. Um, there's a bit of an argument to, uh, to it. We're passing red. We're passing red. So it's a, it's a blue card. Not the best blue card. Nothing really great in this pack. Another mediocre pack. Again, the only thing uh, that's prominent over here is Dreadmaw's Ire, Cosmium Blast, and uh, Rumbling Rock Slide. The others are very, very passable. Walk with the Ancestors. Yeah, if you're in green, walk this, mill it. I don't know. But yeah, we are pra passing Dreadmaw's Ire uh, in favor of Tishana Stidebinder. You never know. It might be in white, blue uh, again, which would be really good. Yeah, see? White. Grabbing white. Here's black with Souls of the Lost. Souls of the Lost with black green is actually really, really good. You can also opt for... If they're passing black... We might be in black business. I mean, yeah. If they're passing black, we can go for black green. I haven't really seen any green cards. If we mill this, if we get the spider back, this would be so good. Also, on the wheel, we can get the rampaging spike tail. Most of these are pretty much, yeah, passable. Except for the Ultic Cloud Guard. Ultic Cloud Guard is really good. Do we let go of the Ultic Cloud Guard? It's one of four. So this is pick four. Pick four, we have the option of going red, blue. Here's red. We passed a lot of red. So I'm thinking red ain't available. Probably black then, right? We need to see a lot of the... Uh, the... Uh, mushroom. The Death Touch Mushroom. We're going to try to go black. Pick four. The pass is red, but we passed red as well. Some blue, maybe blue, black, Demir. Maybe. Yeah, see? Blue with the waterlogged Hulk, right? That's a pretty component with the Souls of the Lost. We're not passing anything awesome here. Uh, except for the Cavern Stomper, but we're very far off from green. Maybe 
Yeah. Yeah, that's required for the mill deck. Let's see if we can go with the mill deck. Okay. We're seeing more, uh, more green. Not seeing a lot of great red though. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna switch to green. Pick six, we got a lot more green. Okay, green's open. Maybe black can be open, so we're not getting any of these back except maybe the hidden nursery. But green is quite open. Uh, white too. If black's open, that's okay. Captivating cave is also a pick, but I think I'd I'd rather have ray of ruin here. Okay. Another Hulk, sure. Or is it the hidden necropolis? So, Millicard. This is blue, though. All right, took that. What are we getting? Cavern, Somper, Walk of the Ancestors. Maybe white is open. That's a passable. All right. Blue. Blue, green. I'm not seeing a deck here. Black. Like this. Our green cards are pretty good, so that's a Miller. Maybe you get lucky and we get thrown and we'll have something. Nope. Okay. We can still try to go red, maybe. It's pretty bad. Okay. We don't have stable colors right now. But O'Hare... We might actually be able to just do O'Hare. O'Hare is so good. Yeah, I want to take O'Hare. We are passing Geological Appraiser, Captain Storm. Man, this is nuts. <laughs> the uh, cards we have are pretty nuts. So it's like a reset. We didn't really get anything from the first pack. We had to get good picks here. Or we're toast. Because we took a red card without anything in red. We'll go red green. Green's fine. I mean, we can go for uh, the stuff, but uh, deal an amount of less than O'Hare's power. The source damage. This is a trampling. I mean, this is red. 
that's a better green though we're still gonna try to go red yeah all right cool that's a pretty good pickup mm, we'll be able to get to our big dudes yeah i don't mind this pick at all all right we're gonna try to go big dudes Biggie Dinos. Maybe it's a Sunbird standard? No, it's Biggie Dino. It's Dino Papa. So far, three dinos, four dinos with Galta. Uh, ooh, we got white. We also have red. So maybe we just continue with the... Uh, no, that's pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. Let us cast our big dudes. So on four, we might be able to cast the Rampaging. That's a pretty good pick, but okay, I'm in. Okay, so long as we keep picking up pretty good stuff, I am in. I didn't see what we could wheel, but yeah. So our first picks were meh, really meh. Green doesn't seem to be open, blue doesn't seem to be open, white seems to be something. And because of that, we might actually go into white. We have Cosmium Blast, that's it, but this is pretty good. All right. Ooh, green with the spider or that I think we'll take that. Uh that's not really a great card, but we might need it. <laughs> uh, I don't think we'll use that, but again. Uh very far away from blue. Okay. We got a cave at least. Oh, that's an okay pick. Oh, yes. Wow. We got a couple of hidden nurseries. Let me open Vito. No. No, sir. We're taking a pathfinding axe jaw here. No real picks on uncommons. There are four uncommons here. The only thing is Pathfinding Asha, so we're, we're going for the Dinos again. Because we got the Armored Kin Collar, we have Watley's Final Strike, Thundering Pyre, Rampage, and Saratos. Maybe it's enough to just keep pushing damage. We want more though. Curator, yeah, 12. We're gonna lack quite a bit of cards. Vito is cute but not what we want we're gonna grab the abrade here perfect perfect addition to the deck uh that's pretty good but we can yeah we can ignore that for now we will take the abrade Okay, Rumbling Rock Slide, Burning Sun's Cavalry, or Watley's Final Strike. At least, uh, I'm, I think I'm taking removal here. Our second removal versus a Burning Sun's Cavalry. Sure. Red's being taken, so Red's not probably going to wheel. But I can't 
ignore the Huatli's final strike. We can grab something else for two. Alright, it's either this or the Panicked Altasaur. I'm going to take the Panicked Altasaur here. I have a lot of top end, so we need to fill the two drop slot. That might be a mistake, but okay, Galta still not. All right, great. We got one of the uh, required two drops for this deck. That really is required. Poison Dart Frog. Wow, our second one. It's so good. It is so good. So Galta might actually be in. Maybe we grab a hot. Hot foot gnome. So we can sneak him in on eight. Maybe on seven. I did see a hot foot gnome. I did see a hot foot gnome. Alright. Oh, probably this one, right? Yeah, I mean, that's better. We need playable, so he might be in. Curator and in the presence of Aegis might actually make the deck because we don't have playables. Couple of hidden nurseries. Another five drop, sure, I think. Stuff a two drop. How many artifacts do we have? We have one. Which is what exactly? Sunfire Torch. Okay. Wow, this wheel. That's big. That is big. Um, now for the hidden uh, volcanoes. If you can get a hidden volcano, then. <laughs> yep. So we have our third, or is it a side? Nope. Hidden volcano here. That is perfect. So Seeker of Sunlight's gone. All right. We even have our third one. Hmm. We're not using it. So for value, we have in the presence of ages, we did not get a walk with ancestors though. All right, is it better for Rampaging Ceratops or Malamet Veteran? We'll go the dino route. Number of dinos, nine. O'Hare, hmm, it is a trampling god. Non combat damage. It's only Sunfire Torch in a braid. It says. If a red source you control will deal an amount of non combat damage less than O'Hare's power, that source. So if we put this at 5 with Huatli's final strike. Yeah. Okay. I'm in. Delta and the Golden Lance. Galta and the Golden Lance. Galta and the Golden Lance. So we have nine and then seven, eight, nine, eight. All right. Maybe too much hidden nursery. I don't know. Let's see. Too much tap land might kill us. Let's see. We have three. 
<laughs> Let's try it out in gold that we trust. I hope uh, we didn't get a hot foot gnome. I really should have checked out a hot foot gnome since we first picked Galta, but I mean, if Galta will crash in, I don't know. <laughs> that's that's too good. It's just too good. Cloud man. Yeah. Oh, curator should go out. Curator should go. Oh, no. Maybe we can get a double hit from a nursery or something. That is just wrong, my friend. You should not use its squints that way. Okay, you have a land drop, okay. Battle, battle glyph, okay. This is a V2, it's got a counter. Five, we have four. We're gonna die next turn. Three, three. We have six next turn for the seismic monster sword. We can also just kill this one so he only hits us four. But he has the panicked altasaur next turn, which we should be okay with. Because if we cast this next turn, what's the play then? We can't even defend against that. So maybe it's this. Five, yep. All right. We're supposed to be double blocking, or if he removes something, then. So he is either going to remove something or just play the panicked Altasaur. At five, this is four. Can block four, five. We can final strike that. Yeah. Can we, if we do this, oh, we're going to have to do this. We can't. He's going to hit us for two. We can kill that. And then next turn, poison dart frog. And yeah, okay. Or if he removes the seismic monster sword, we're kind of screwed, but should be okay. Okay. I didn't see. Did he do top top or something? He has to activate this, right? We 
have to use Watley's final strike on that. Uh oh, he's flipping it. Er, he's gonna find something. It's not really good. Okay, he's not attacking with this then. If that's the case, we're just going to remove this. Trying to buy time. Another twist and turns, all right. I guess he's going to, uh, yeah. We need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Can't even cast Galta at this point. Watley's final strike in the presence of ages. Uh. Okay, so he really wants to have that block two or less. We can block it right now. Mm -hmm. I lose both. Yeah, I cannot not have lose both. He's going to be drawing another card off of that, which is pretty bad, but we can match it, I guess. Can't attack because of the poison dart frog. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We can now cast Galta if we draw Galta. One, two, three, four. We still can't do it. Next turn. Okay. Another one? Now he has two. Which 
try to find something. Okay. All right. What, please? So far, no Galta. I didn't see a Galta. Then O'Hare, he's going to be attacking. I can trade it off. Doink, doink. If he attacks, what can I do? What can I do if he attacks? Well, we can't just not do anything. Oh, he's activating it. He's gonna get another creature. 21. Okay, seismic monstrosaur. Yikes. That is pretty bad news. Caller, sure. Nurturing bristle back, sure. Hmm. Huh. So it's dangerous because we have three. We also have two if he decides to do something. We have till four. We have till five, actually. else could he have if we get galta one two three four five six seven eight nine ten we can't cast galta and then trample over because it's one two three four five one two three four five six seven we're gonna have to remove something right now Stripping most of the stuff in his deck. He's going to be left with lands. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 10. He's got 10 playables. That is a huge one. But you can't attack because of my poison dart frog. So something in the air.
Panic Altasaur. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. So, yep. Unless he's got stampeding thing. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Huh? Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. He's got eight playables. Mm -hmm. Eleven. If we hold this, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. He's got to land. He's going to look for two more. He's not going to attack. I think we play it. The only thing that'll win him this game is if he has stampeding the stampeding thing. Quatley's final strike. Ay ay ay. That is going to kill us. Cause he's gonna do stampeding strike on the poison dart frog. He doesn't have anything else. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. He's got twelve cards. He doesn't have any creatures left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Huh. What can we get from here? Because we can. Um, armored Kin Collar, Burning. Sun's Cavalry, Cavern Stomper, and Galta. Well, we can grab the Panicked Altasaur, right? Three, one, two, three, five Panicked Altasaur and land. Or the Kin Collar. 14, 12. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. He attacks with two. I'm gonna die. I need to get something right now. So if I take the armored kin collar, I can cast it right now. I don't die next turn. Yeah. Yeah.
I couldn't do Galta because we die next turn. The problem now is we're down to 10. He's at 11. He can keep grabbing creatures. I think he doesn't have any creatures left. Does he? He does. So he's going to crap out more than we are, right? He's going to draw Watley's final strike. Uh, we already used both of our Huatli's final strike. We have what else? Panicked Altasaur, and Paging Ceratops, the Cavern Stomper. Panicked Altasaur will not really do anything for us. So it'll boil down to what exactly? <sighs> yeah, all right. We're still at this. But he's going to deck before we do. He's going to duck before we do. Did he draw Huatlis now? Yeah, because he's got Huatlis for sure. So he'll be able to remove one, remove that, and then what? Interesting. All right. He still has the. He still has that thing to draw. Watley's final strike. Doesn't have any other creatures. He doesn't have any more creatures. Seven lands. Yeah, he has Watley's final strike and seven lands. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. I think he'll deck before us. What else can we draw? We can only draw the Cavern Stomper and the Panicked Altasaur. That's that's it. The Cavern Stomper and the Panicked Altasaur. There's nothing else in our deck. So we got nothing. We're going to have to hold this. So that's quite useless. You got nothing else, dude. Do you? Yeah, you have nothing. Quatley's final strike is your last. Jade seed stones. You don't have tramplers. That's a problem, though. Now he can improve the scout and the burning sun's cavalry. We're going to die with that. We're going to block his biggest creatures. Jade Light Spelunker and that. Yeah, all right. Resolve it. Four. Still fine. Okay. Here's the alpha. Got to make good blocks now. All right. 
That's for sure. This is for sure. This is for sure. This is for sure. Chomp. Four, four, that's four, four, that's seven. Nope, can't. Three, four, this is, huh, two. Four, four, three, block. We can't survive that. Three, four. Can we pull a swing back? We can't. This is two. This is four, four. Oh, there's nothing. Mm. Yeah, I don't think so. Four. All right, we have assigned all blockers, right? Yeah, okay. Only we had something for that, but we don't. We're dead. So maybe if we took Galto? If we had Galto, it didn't matter. Five, right? Yeah, we couldn't die. We couldn't. We just couldn't die on that same turn, but he still had us. He still had us. What was that girl doing? Curator. Yikes. Not supposed to be in the deck, but yeah, we had <laughs> what first game, dude. First game that was the first game, and it was already an epic match. So, red, green, red, green, curator is gone for what? Curator for Daring Discovery, right? So we have a chance. Because if we can do that and then Daring Discovery. Yeah. 19. Yeah, that's probably it. All right. Daring Discovery. Let's see. O'Hare. Yikes. We can keep just blocking with O'Hare. Right? Okay, I'm in, right? Nothing else, nothing else, nothing else, nothing else. Yeah, nothing else. Okay. Maybe open Galta at five or six with a couple other creature cards in our hand. I don't know. Let's uh, keep it open. Do we have an extra rampaging ceratops? Nope. We got two, three. We don't even have a great four drop. Well, no. Is this better? Because I think it's better. We 
You were late, my friend. We're not attacking because if he attacks, I can go ahead and block this. If he doesn't, then we can do Rampaging Ceratops. Oh, okay. Yeah, we'll Huatli strike this. <laughs> Sheesh. Yeah, okay. No blocks. Alright, we have one, two, three, four, five. Five mana. Oh, we can't. We'll just what least this. can attack will miss we can he has to equip play a one drop he lacks lands One. Okay. Okay. Let's see what he gets. Oh, okay. No problem. Eighteen. Okay. No blocks. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six. to rush it could be a two bows my place my place we don't need to keep in touch all right totes totes good totes all right just gonna tap both of those Okay. Boink. We had a chance for Galt of that game. Six, seven? Maybe. No, but we still didn't have a hand. Like, we had Itali's favor. We didn't even get to cast Itali's favor. Cod piece. 
cod piece. All right. Four. Yup. Ain't, ain't good. Ain't good. Oh, we're gonna do panic altasaur with O'Hare. Oh god. Oh gosh, this will be good. This will be good. This will be good. Panic, Altasaur. Are you gonna go for five? No, for three, four. Ah, oh, crap. It'll be a five. Yeah, it'll be a five. Oh, it's a four. Okay. Cool. Hope he doesn't petrify this. Because if he doesn't petrify this, we should be okay. But petrify is the only thing that'll really screw us. Or maybe join the dead. I don't know. Join the dead as well. We'll get rid of the panicked Altasaur. But if he doesn't, he'll at least hit for four. Okay. That's kind of not great. Five, six, and five. This is what exactly? One, two, three, four. We hit another land. We should be okay otherwise. Yeah, all right, cool. Five turn clock. It's a five turn clock. What is that? Three. Yikes. That colony, how many? And you can't, your bats can't even attack. What is that? Five. I don't know what he's doing. We are not attacking. We're just clicking the Altasaur. Okay. So if he does that, right? Five. We can definitely block that. What does he do if we block this? Do we block like this? What happens if we block like this? We're just gonna block like that. What is he doing? Final strike. 
Okay. Seven thirteen. So, what can we do next turn? What the heck? So we can't attack? Only as a sorcery. One, two, three, four, five. I can attack, but I can't get rid of this. His attack back is what exactly? His attack back is... Uh, his attack back is... 13. If he can get another counter, it should be okay. Well, we're dead if he gets another counter. If he doesn't, then... What else can we do? We couldn't. We couldn't get a... Uh, two, one, four, five, six, seven, eight. Galta? Oh, Jade Seedstone's going to, uh, what? Do you have an artifact? No, you don't have any artifacts. Oh, you need what? You need a creature. You'll heal up. Yikes, that's bad. That's really bad. Mm-hmm. Five, so seven, eleven, eight. <sighs> non combat damage this turn and only as a sorcery. Ooh. 
this is 11. I can't have him attack. So what to do exactly? Man, if I had that, I would have just I would just attack right now. But I do not, so crap. Another Watley's, please. Or remove this. <laughs> He had Watley. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So if he had double blocked that, we would have lost, like, terribly. Counter on both the bats. Rampaging Ceratops would be so good. Rampaging Ceratops. Um, Rampaging Ceratops is a draw. Yeah, Rampaging Ceratops. We have three of you in the deck. Come on, Urgalta. That was probably wrong, using Huatlis like that. Oh, he's destroying an enchantment. Three, I'm dead? Probably dead, right? Still can't do it. All right, yikes. Now we're kind of screwed, like. Huatlis. So, whatever happens, I am dead next turn, right? Yeah, I shouldn't have used Watley's right like that. I thought I, I, I could attack. No, wait, no. This, the, the reason why I used Watley's was I can't cast it. I couldn't cast it. Right? Add two mana. Oh, he would know about it. I, cause we took it on. Hmm. That's just so bad. All right, well, really can't do anything about this. So unfortunate. He just needs the alpha. In the presence of ages. Yeah, we don't really have anything else. Uh-huh. There you go. Malamut Battle Glyph, which will not do anything. Alpha! Great. Yep. Yeah. Didn't have anything, dude. You just needed to alpha. <sighs> well, it's still a pretty good game. I mean, yikes. But yeah. Um, still kind of... Uh, come on, Galta. Play. We don't have anything better, <laughs> unfortunately. We have that. Well, we can do Curator of the Sun, but for what? The, uh... Mm, can get the, uh, this is four, Discover four, right? So Discover four, and the best ones we have are our top end, actually. If we had, uh, hmm, maybe we shouldn't have used it. 
I really don't know. We're lopsided for the big guns, but we're not do drawing our big guns. Yeah, ha, ha. On target creature. Nope, we're gonna continue with this. Maybe instead of this, we put the Malamet veteran, yeah? Yeah, I think I like that. Because that really doesn't do anything to damage. But the Malamet Veteran with all the mana. Yeah. The thing is for Discover, it's pretty bad for Discover. Discover requires that you have like lower casting cost creatures, I guess. Oh well. We managed to pull one victory. I think that's all we can muster for this deck, unfortunately. Or have we gotten two wins? I don't know. Have we gotten two wins? Okay, entering match. Uh, no. Uh, okay. We got Ernie Sun and. No, please don't flood. We are flooding hard. sad opened with four mana and we drew nothing but lands three draws and nothing but lands ah uh, well this is six damage Yeah, cause why not? Ouch. Probably the dot, yeah. Yep. No props, dude. You are gonna flood us like crazy. Really. You are gonna flood us like crazy. I didn't even do that. Wow. Really? So if I do this, it's guaranteed uh, end. You can also do the Pathfinding Axe Draw, but that really doesn't matter. It's the god, yeah. This way we can have more lands. And we can actually defend on this. Except if he petrifies it. And now we have no choice but to... Six damage, eight. Okay. Damn, all we drew were lands. Great job, deck. Great job. Another land? Give it to me. Yeah, all right, fine. I'm gonna take that. Mm. 
Mm, and right on time. He's gonna attack for sure. We're gonna have to block it. This will die. I can't even block that. Yep. Definitely. So this bigger than that. This will die for sure. What we have. But that's removed. This one's three. Yeah, we lost. Chomp this. We do that. Can you kill both? You can kill both! No, you can't. Mm, are you an artifact? No, you're a god. So we can't do anything with that, so we're gonna do this. See what we get, right? Go to, okay, human stuff. You're just going to, what exactly, do nothing. Six, you have to block. Plundering pirate, Itali's favor. Armored kin collar, ooh. Hmm. That really doesn't do anything because I can't even kill that one. Um, another one, even if I draw Galta now, which I won't because it's at the bottom, this is still better. Two, three, four, five, six. Well, at least three. Really? Seriously? Like, seriously? Seriously? Why? Oh, Watley's in destroy. What? So, two for that. Flooded hard, like hard flood. Ah, yeah, come on, man. All we drew were lands in the presence of ages, revealed three lands and O'Hare, and then we succeeded to draw two more lands. Then we did Hidden Nursery, revealing more lands. Oh, magic. Magic, magic, magic. Magic, magic, magic. That draft was extremely poor. Yar yar. We did not have enough playables, and... 
everything was stop end basically and we didn't draw anything we had so many lands eight lands we we had 10 lands in the last match 10 lands but none of our none of our top end none of our top end Burning Sun Cavalry, a couple of Watis, Final Strike, which we couldn't even use to kill anything. It was disgusting. Disappointing. Apologies for the saltiness, but if you made it this far, you know what to do. I'll see you on the next one.